Tiny Peach's Kitchen with Chris and Blair. Today we're making sweet potato pie challenge baked in or boiled potatoes. So today our challenge is going to be because people say I like baked potatoes better in my sweet potato pie and some say I like boiled potatoes better in my sweet potato pie. The difference is I feel it's a preference because I cook it both ways. So today I'm going to do baked potatoes and I'm going to do boiled potatoes. And what I'm going to do is go out and do the challenge and have people try it. And nobody will know those numbers except for me. And those numbers will be one and two. One will represent one and one will represent two. So therefore when the people taste it, you'll know when we come in and I'm going to sneak and tell you which is which and then They'll take the challenge, and you can do the challenge and let us know which is better at that point. And this is amazing, guys, because this is our first challenge, and it won't be the last. Yeah. Bye. Yeah. We'll see you later. Okay, we're about to wash these potatoes. We didn't let them soak, but they, they're dirty, so I'm going to scrub them up and get them clean. This is why I wash the sweet potatoes. They're clean now, they're drying, and then I'll go ahead and bake and boil some. We're going to get this process started. We got our potatoes on for baking. We're going to put those at 400 and bake them in the oven. And we're going to put these on the stove and bake them for about mm, 45 minutes and check them at that point. We'll be right back. Hey y'all, uh, these potatoes were cleaned. These sweet potatoes were cleaned and dried out. And I'm going to take a couple, stick them in the oven, and take some and boil them so I can make my sweet potato pie and so that I can make my um, candy yams. And I just wanted to see if it was true, which I know is, you know, depending on for people that overboil, if there's a difference, but it's a personal preference. And two, it's a time thing if you have time, but some people just have a personal preference that it was the way that they were taught how to bake or how to boil. And so they do it that way. I do both. It just depends on what mood I'm in or if I have space in the oven or space on the stove. So today I'm going to make it my business to stick some in the oven. I'm going to make sure I put foil under it so I don't have the mess that comes along with it. But I'm going to also boil some on the stove so that you guys can see. I'm going to do a taste tester with some people and I'm going to put one and two. And the only people that's going to know what one and two is would be me. And so I'm going to um, let the boys give these taste testers out and we're going to do those numbers and figure it out and crunch it up. And we'll see who, which does, do they taste the same or is there a personal preference or one over the other okay the oven sweet potatoes came out after an hour i put a couple holes in them and they start drizzling from those holes i'm going to take them out of this pan and put them in a bowl and start the mixing up process okay here are the potatoes that were um boiled here back here are the ones that were baked we got butter, we got eggs, we got brown sugar, we got white sugar. I usually buy it in a big container and it sits in a huge container. Um, so I just pour some in there, but just to show you, we have sugar. We got carnation, evaporated milk, we have vanilla extract, cinnamon, ground nutmeg, and we have I use a little lemon extract in mine. So for each pie, there will be one pound of sweet potatoes. There will be um, a half a cup of butter, which is one stick. There will be a half a cup of milk, condensed, evaporated. There will be two eggs per. per. Um, I have some pie crush, you know, well, not the shells. I'll be putting it in glass. Um, and then we have the uh, white sugar I usually use about three-fourth cup give or take in each pie I usually use about one-fourth cup of brown sugar packed and I usually use about a teaspoon of ground nutmeg a, 
excuse me, a half a teaspoon of brown nutmeg, a half a teaspoon of cinnamon, a teaspoon of vanilla extract, a fourth teaspoon of lemon extract, and a teaspoon of flour. So, um, after you've mixed all of that, you can pretty much taste it and see if you're missing anything. Um, if you're not, then you can go forward. I will put my recipe down below and you can go from there. Thank you, you all, and I will be back. Okay, guys, so we weighed the um, sweet potatoes that we did for the baked. And after baking them, they only came up to 1.28, which is like one and a third of what it's supposed to weigh so what i'm going to do is when i go ahead to make the pie i'm going to um do it to like one and a third so i'm going to measure up so that i can use it for something else like making um sweet potato cheesecake so uh we'll be back okay guys so all i did was take those four baked potatoes and um, I mixed them up and then I'm gonna put all of these seasonings in of course we got the um, the one teaspoon of excuse me a half a teaspoon of cinnamon a half I mean yeah cinnamon a half a teaspoon of nutmeg a fourth teaspoon of lemon extract a teaspoon of vanilla extract and then the brown sugar which is a fourth of a cup packed and then we're going to have three fourth of a cup of sugar we have a teaspoon of flour and we have a stick of butter and two eggs and we got those over here so we're going to mix all of that together and then i'm going to show you what the consistency looks like and we forgot the cup of milk we got that too so we got to put all of that in and then we'll show you what the consistency looks like so hey guys this is um what it should look like the thing of it is remember i started off with more than the pound so i had to to uh measure accordingly and i did make a mistake and say one cup of milk it's only one half of um a cup of milk i said that in the beginning which was a half a cup but i i think i did however it's just one half a cup per one pound so um when you're making it make sure you only use a half a cup i Excuse me, I apologize. I had to make mine um, up to the consistency of what I had. So I had to try to uh, make do. So don't go by the measurements just there. I'll put the measurements in the bottom so you can do yours accordingly. Um, thanks. Okay, guys. So let me tell you. Um, You'd be better off just buying you some already uh, pie crust. I had some, but I put them in the refrigerator, and I wasn't pleased with the way they turned out from the refrigerator. So I just went on, and uh, because I wanted to just put them right in the oven. So I just went on and threw those away, and I just used my pie crust that I was going to use for something else. So this is what it should look like. I'm going to go ahead and do put it in the oven, and... Um, I'm going to go ahead and I'll tell you how long it cooks, but I will um, let you know. I'm going to make all of the other pies without going this route. Um, with you know, You're going to do for each pie the same measurements. If you want to put all of the measurements in one thing or whatever, I already know how much I need for my other ones because I've already separated. So this is where we are. I'm going to stick this in the oven and we'll see you back. All right, guys. The pies are done. So we're not, I'm not going to tell the boys which is which, but uh, one is baked and well, both of them are baked at the end of the day, but one of the potatoes were baked and one of the potatoes was boiled and one of the potatoes was baked and one of the potatoes was boiled. So you have to let them decide which one tastes better to them. They cannot know what the other one says i'm going to have them do their testing at a different time so they can't choose which was best for whom Hi. okay so we got two pieces here from this pie and we got two of these here from this pie hey. so blair grab yours chris grab yours from this pie okay oh no this pie okay Which pie are you eating? 
Told me. Okay, that's one. Okay, come on, scoot in near your brother. I was trying to do y'all at separate times. This is good. I, it tastes good. Okay. Mm. Okay. Now tell me how the other one tastes compared to that. Mm. You go. You go out of here, Chris. Don't. Uh. Uh. Don't say nothing. Get out of here, Chris. Wait. Let me taste my. This one is better. Mm. Wait. No. This one's better. You don't even know which one. Yeah, I do. This one. Okay. That one boy. Hold on, wait, wait. You gotta come back over here and tell me that telling me something boiled or something is baked. This is the best. Those are clean dishes back Sunny, there, people. They the just best. stacked in the um Sunny, on a dish the rack. Okay, so that one came from here. So he likes Blair likes this one better. Come here, uh Chris. You need to come here. Hurry up. I'm here. Go over there. You yeah. taking this too long. I already ate my Oh, I'm you here. ate that one all up. Mm -hmm. Okay, so which one which one did you like better? It depends. Because you don't know which one is which. The which people's got to know. The people's got to know. Which one you like better? So you like this one better? Which one? Point to the one y'all like, like better. One, like hey, which one is which? Okay, these little ones came from this one. Okay, that's one. So you like this one better? Yeah, because I eat the crust with it. Okay. I like this mm, too, but... You like them both? Yeah. Okay, so... I really don't have... Uh, that has nothing under the bottom. Let's see what this one has under the bottom. No, no. Hold no, this. No. See, that's Hold baked. This. That's boiled. Ha! <laughs> and it says that is baked. No! <laughs> no. <laughs> So, uh, the boil pies won it with these two. And these two are food connoisseurs. They know usually what's what. And when I bake, they both taste good is what they said. But this one here is the boiled one. And this one is the one that they like. I knew. The oh, best. I like the bake one And now. this one, oh, you like the <laughs> bake one now. <laughs> and this one is the bake one. Uh-oh. He had a, uh, I don't know uh, what that actually. was. So, anywho. And this one is the baked one, and they liked the boiled one better, which I do both, so it really doesn't matter here at my house, but let, let's see what it does at your house. You do a, tra a challenge at your house. And comment. Hello. Hello. Um, make sure to like, to subscribe, and comment down below which one, Scooty and Blair, which, I can't which, get you. which one you think is better, just like he said. And make sure to share this with all your friends or anybody that's in your family. And thank y'all so much. Now time to do the subscriber dance. Mm. Peace out.